DaVinci Resolve is one of the best premium video editors which we can use free of cost. First we will download the setup file for Linux and then we will proceed to the installation part. You do not need to put your exact details, you can type anything and click on register and download. After downloading, extract the downloaded archive and execute the setup file. If you receive the same error which you are seeing here, then you need to install Fuse Package. I am using Arch Linux, so I can type sudo pacman's fuse2 and it will install the package. If you are using any Debian or Fedora based distro, Fuse2 will be available for those distros too. Now I will run the setup again and the error should be gone. After installing, we will run the program. But it's not running, so we will run the program from the terminal to see if there are any errors. As you can see, we are getting libcrypt error. So, we will install that dependency from AUR to fix this error. Now, we will run Resolve and as you can see there is no error, but a white window. We can force close this window as it doesn't affect anything. Resolve will take some time at the first launch, and if you're getting unsupported GPU processing mode error as I am seeing here, then you need to install OpenCL NVIDIA package. If you get this error then there is a possibility that Resolve is not using your graphics card at all. Sometimes we will get 999 error also. It is for the same reason. So, to fix this, we will have to ask Resolve to use our NVIDIA card instead of the integrated GPU. Now, we will run DaVinci Resolve with some environment variables added. You can directly add it to the application shortcut to make it permanent. I'll put the environmental variables in the video description for you. DaVinci Resolve in Linux will not support MKV or MP4 videos. It will only support MOV videos. In the next video, I'll show you how you can convert videos with just right-click menu. If your DaVinci Resolve UI is too small, you can increase the UI scale as per your requirement. It's very easy to do it. Follow what I am doing. Thank you from the bottom of my heart for watching this video till the end. Please give a thumbs up and subscribe this channel if you like this content and want to watch more content like this in future.
It's been an incredible adventure, and I hope to see you all in the next chapter of our Linux gaming journey. It's Q, signing off.